In this video, I'm going to apply the concepts of uh, polynomial into solving real-world problems. Um, think of an electronic store that sells some electronic items um, online, and their revenue, R of x, is given by negative 3x squared plus 280x, where x is the number of items sold. And the cost for producing x items is c of x equal to 150 plus 40x. Now, we need to find the profit for this function. I meant profit for this store, or we are looking for profit function. Remember that profit function, P of X, is equal to revenue minus cost. Or in general, revenue minus cost is profit. So that's your profit. Now, my revenue function is R of X given, so it should be R of X minus cost function C of X. So, your profit is equal to revenue minus cost, or profit function P of X is equal to revenue function R of X minus cost function or cost structure C of X. And we are given that R of X is negative 3X square plus 280x, then from that we need to subtract uh, the cost function, which is 150 plus 40x. Now, before I go any further, I want to clarify one thing. I made a mistake here on purpose to make sure that you folks follow it. If you wrote it as it is, there is a mistake. The mistake is that you are not subtracting the entire cost function. What you should be doing, this is your profit, I mean revenue function, and from that you need to subtract the cost function, which is this function. So you need to put a parenthesis around it. So, which means that I need to distribute this negative sign in, inside the parenthesis for all of the factors, all of the numbers there. So P of X is equal to negative 3X squared plus 280 x minus 150 so negative that's like multiplying everything inside by negative 1 so negative 1 times 150 is negative 150 negative 1 times 40 x is negative 40 x now if I combine or simplify things I'm gonna get profit function is equal to negative 3 x square 280 x minus 40 x is gonna be 240 x then minus 150 and that's the profit function for the electronic store that's online so this is one very simple example of application of polynomials into real world uh, but there are many many applications of polynomials even the very basic simple first second or third order polynomials uh, are very very useful i hope that this discussion was helpful thank you very much